welcome to a duplex and to another legendary night where we will have Lost Frequencies, the DJ 28 in the world, where we will be enjoying his new single Dive and we will be having a really good night. Come with me. And the feeling goes on and on and on and the feeling goes on and on and on. We are here with Felix from Lost Frequencies. We're very excited to have you here. You are the first Belgian artist that comes to Duplex. We're very excited about that. And also, we would like to congratulate you because you are the first Belgian artist to hit 1 billion streams on your single, Where Are You Now? Congratulations, Felix. What do you feel about that? Uh, thank you very much. So yes, I am the apparently I am the first Belgian artist to play here by one month because my colleagues Dimitri Vegas like Mike will be here next month. So you can tell them they, they are the second. <laughs> um, and yes, I have a track that uh, has one billion streams. It's pretty crazy. I never really expected to have uh, such a big track, especially after Are You With Me. I thought Are You With Me was going to be my biggest single for the rest of my career uh, because it was such a big hit. It's nice to see that now with Where Are You Now, we achieved even higher levels. And now I have an album coming out in November so there's a lot of exciting stuff coming up. How did the, the name Lost Frequencies came out and what does it mean for you? At the start I was uh, producing with a lot of different, uh, a lot, a few different projects. So um, I had uh, also other stuff. If you look it up on SoundCloud maybe you find them. Um, and Lost Frequencies was one of them and with Lost Frequencies I was making remixes of old tracks and those old tracks would be the Lost Frequencies I take back and remix into a house world. I just wanna dive into your love, your love. Talking about your tracks and your new single, Dive, I see it's already trending in TikTok. What do you think, like, these new platforms like TikTok, does they have an important role in the music industry right now? Uh, they do have an important role. Um, the labels love it uh, for to promote music. It's a really good way to uh, create hype on a track. But it's also double-edged because I also think you can have a, a profile where you grow super quickly. You create a profile for an upcoming artist and you think you actually have hype when actually you, you, don't, you don't really have hype. It's more like people, they see your videos but they don't especially know who you are. Uh, you can have like these 15 seconds of fame which can be very dangerous and you can think you are someone when actually it's not because you have a few videos that, that are uh, going viral that you are famous, you know. Felix, we have a surprise for you. We have your own vinyl, your own record. No, and we would like you to sign it. And now you can hang it. Felix, one last thing. We usually make game with the DJs coming to backstage. Surprise questions, you just need to pick one. What is your guilty pleasure in music? I guess I would say drum and bass. I play some drum and bass in the sets yeah, and some, sometimes uh, I play too much drum and bass <laughs> because sometimes the people that come to, to see me they're not especially drum and bass fans but so sometimes it works and I'm like oof nice they, they, they get it so I'm gonna play some more but and sometimes I'm like oh they get it I want to play some more actually they, they, they were hyped but they had enough after one track so I need to calm, calm it down and go back to, to something else but I'm gonna try tonight for sure again drum and bass and see how it goes What's up Duplex this is Lost Frequencies see you tonight on the dance floor for a big party I just wanna dive into